Hey guys, I decided to make one more video tonight. Um, that's because I was afraid I would chicken out if I waited until tomorrow to do more. Um, this will just be like the little odds and ends, I guess. Um, are, I guess I can just take you for a little walk through the newspaper, basically. Um, the front cover, and again, this is mainly intended for the blind fans um, of Radiohead. The front cover is the King of Limbs art, which hopefully um, somebody has described to you by now. But it says, Universal Psy released into the world unto this day. Um, the second page includes those four short stories that are in my other video, Frozen, Fairy Dust, Out of It, In It, Out of It, and Haunt, and includes um, one of Stanley Donwood's Divided Woods pictures, um, lithographs, drawings. The third page is headlined Across the Great Divide, and includes the artwork from the actual CD release of The King of Limbs, as well as a number of... Um, lyrics like from Mr. Magpie, some uh, some lyrics from Bloom, from Lotus Flower, and yes it is just to feed your fast ballooning head. There's been some debate over what that line was. Um, okay, so the fourth page is a short story by Robert McFarlane called Tree Climbing. Um, the fifth page is some artwork by Donwood and Chalk, or at this point, maybe they want to be called Wildwood and Twain, I don't know, um, with some of the Twisted Woods artwork on it. Um, the sixth page is some more uh, Donwood and Chalk shenanigans um, with the headline, Gather Up the Pitiful, being a line from Give Up the Ghost. Um, the seventh page is a bunch of little clips of... Um, different, well, as people would say, Yorkian ramblings. <laughs> uh, the eighth page is a story by Jay Griffiths called Forests of the Mind. Um, that continues on to the ninth page. Um, the tenth page is some heavily processed photographs and the word infinity. Page 11 is a short story by Stanley Donwood called Sell Your House and Buy Gold. And then the back cover, the 12th page, again is Universal Psy, released into the world on this day. And um, a creature I call Mr. Pink um, to distinguish him from Arbor and Spiky or whatever the nicknames of the ghosts on the cover of The Kim Limbs are. Um, it's this pink creature that's in the shape of arms from the King of Limbs tree. Um, and the message, please do not litter.